Hey everybody, it's your nightly 90 and it is the 90th episode. Uh, it's, it's been a long 90 days and I think uh, it's fitting that today's title is my last one. You know, I, I'm out here in beautiful California with my kids and my friends and uh, it's, it's fitting. It's a beautiful, majestic place to have this, this 90th episode. And the 90th episode is, is more of a, a point that I want to drive home for people in the concept of how you are sitting with yourself this very, very moment. April 15th, 2014. A beautiful April day. The sun was out. My brother's wife were visiting from North Carolina. Um, me and my siblings all were visiting my mom. You know, it was, it was, a, it was a day that was memorable. I remember we'd all visit my mom. We'd all dispersed. We were going to go back and visit her that night. So we were all out getting meals and coming back. And I got back before everybody else did. And it was me, my mom, my dad, and my grandma. And I remember that it was me and my mom's right side, my dad and my mom's left side, my grandma and my mom's left side. And me and my dad were staring up at a heart rate monitor and we were watching slowly as the heartbeat of my mother decreased. Uh, I remember watching my mom's breath get more shallow every second. I remember calling my sibling and saying, hurry back. I remember staring at my mom, holding her right hand as she took her last breath. And it was, uh, it was one of the most like hard, painful things I've experienced in my life. My mom uh, was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis 17 years ago. You know, my mom had life taken away from her. She wasn't able to experience many things. She wasn't able to perceive the world, the world in a certain way. You know, she was wheelchair bound two years in, and it was something where I watched this life be stripped of her in terms of potential and dreams and, and things she could do. She used to go and ski lakes just like this. She used to be jovial and vibrant and, and so fun. It was a beautiful woman. This woman adopted me when I was a young kid who honestly didn't deserve the kind of love she showed me. And so that day, that day when her life ended, that last one, that last day was, one, it was, it was beautiful to see my mom for the first time out of pain. Two, it was something where it was a great start to something else. You know, I, I watched this take place where life was, was taken in, my mom's life was ended full of potential, full of amazing potential. And so for me, I said in my life, after all the things she allowed me to do, give me the ability to, to perceive the world the way I do and live the life I have and have my kids, like everything I have in life was because of what she was able to provide for me in just sheer love and ability. And I said, I don't want myself, my kids, anybody that I know, friends, people I will know like yourself, to ever go through life and have to be in a situation where you look back on it and you passed full of potential. So tonight's topic is to think about if this was your last one, would it be worth it? It's cliche, you've probably heard it before, I realize that, but cliche things usually are, are said because they mean something. So when I say to you, if it's your last one, is it worth it, how'd you live it? Like really, when this video ends, you have to start thinking in your brain immediately about what is the next moment, the literal moment after the video ends, what is my life going to be? You know, I can give you all the motivational stuff and, and give you a bunch of quotes. You can read quotes and send them back and forth on social media, but the reality is, is your life is taking place right now. Like this very moment is taking place and you have to pull something for every moment in your life to be remembered, to be shared, to be shown, to be something that you can look back on proud of and your friends and family can look back on proud of. And if you don't make something of it, then you're gonna leave this earth with so many things you could have done. So when I leave this with you guys today, I want you to sit on that, think about it. If you, are, if you have health, if you have the ability to watch this video, there's so much going for you. So you need to make a decision of what you're gonna do with your life. What's gonna be greater, if it's gonna be great, if it's gonna be something that's memorable, if it already is great, how are you gonna share that? Like whatever takes place for you is supposed to be great, go do that. Because like my mom, it's a very good possibility that it could be your last one. So with that, I leave you guys as always. Let, I want you guys to know I love all of you. It's, it's unique that I have this kind of unconditional love and it comes from my mom and I wanna share it with you guys, which is why I do these things. These are not over. They will continue to keep coming until I pass myself. But I leave with the same thing I leave with all the time. Good night, God bless, and go Ducks.